tell me about your character and how is it different in this film versus previous ones? Let's see, well, at this point in the series, Damien has kind of accepted himself as part of the Teen Titans. Uh, he's brought himself into the family, and Damien has been on both sides of the specter. He was, you know, on the evil side, you know, with the League of Assassins and everything, and slowly went over to Batman's side, Justice, not Vengeance. So, being on both sides now, he can kind of see, he can easily determine what others are. So, um, when Tara joins the group, and he sees, like, her being a little more isolationist on the uh, on the outside and such, uh, he kind of sees a little bit of his former self in her, and of course, you know, he would want to stop that thing, you know, uh, you know, as he's kind of on the, on the lighter side now. Now, he does it in his own unique way, by things like uh, stalking her through the cities <laughs> and keeping an eye on her. But, uh, hey, he tries what he tries. He tries. <laughs> stalking, eh? Hmm. But he means well, right? Yes, so. he means well. Okay. He means well. <laughs> yes. Watchful eyes. Okay. All right. Now, uh, what in particular about this film stands out to you as being different from the rest of the DC Universe films? Yeah. Uh, what stands out here is that uh, the Teen Titans, um, we're all like a big family, but at the same time, we all have these big disputes going on, like a Modern Family episode, you know, like, uh, Beetle Boy's having, uh, issues, like, you know, with connecting with the people, um, Beast Boy's having love issues, a uh, little romance going on there, um, uh, there's some stuff going on between, uh, Nightwing and Starfire, and, uh, of course, you know, I'm always up to something, <laughs> you know, so, yeah, it's just, everyone's, um, we're, up, everyone's up to something, and there's, a, there's always disputes we have to go over, but, uh, at the end, we all come together, uh, through the thick and thin, we're a family. And do you have any similarities to your character? Uh, definitely. For one, I do take martial arts. Uh, I am a black belt candidate in Taekwondo. Nice. So that helped with uh, a lot of the ADR stuff and all the, uh, the dancing around all the machine gun bullets and everything. So that was cool. And um, although one thing that I'm not like with Damien is um, I'm not as much of a brat as he is. But I love that because I don't get to be like that around the house. <laughs> so it's a fun way to do things that you wouldn't normally be able to do because that's not who you really are. Exactly, yeah. And any other cool projects you have coming out that you want people to know about? Uh, at this point, uh, I'm actually kind of just uh, slowing down a little bit, uh, which is good for uh, for college. I hope to, you know, I'm staying local, by the way, though. You know, I can, so I can still keep to do uh, keep doing stuff like this. But uh, yeah, just uh, on hiatus, waiting to see what's up next. Great. And any other final words on the new film? Uh, final words on the new film? On this one. Uh, Teen yes. Titans. Yes. 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 Um, all right. I guess I'll um, put uh, one of my favorite parts of the movie right. in here. Uh, my favorite part in the film is when. When Damien uh, comes face to face with a nemesis that he hasn't seen in a while and just the pure spitefulness that you see on his face and the realization that he's back is so great and the uh, the uh, the upcoming duel afterwards is awesome but it doesn't go his way like he think it would All right, yeah cool. great well thank you so much thank you